Good morning, everyone. I hope you are having a blessed week so far. And thank you so much for taking time to watch my videos. This is just a little reminder of tonight's Leo full moon service. This service is all about cementing your personal and professional and romantic relationships. Um, it's also about experiencing joy and allowing your desires to come through and allowing them to be felt and acknowledged and fulfilled. A lot of times we kind of get down on ourselves for wanting things or wanting to achieve things and we can have a lot of negative self-talk uh, that really can set us back and put us down and, and stop us from working towards a goal. And this full moon is not about that. It is about encouraging you and bringing um, positive, uplifting people into your life. We talk about the Leo full moons being focused on you finding your pride, finding your pride of lions. So if you are looking to start a project, start a new job, start a new relationship, you're dating, start a business, um, a promotion, this is a great time to align and draw in the people that are going to help you do that. Having a supportive system around you is probably, even if it's one person, I would say that is a huge key to success. That's been a huge key to my success. My husband was a huge support with me starting my business. Um, anybody who didn't really, um, who I thought would not be helpful or not be positive or would try to give me advice from a place that they'd never experienced what I was trying to do, I stayed away from those people. And that can be hard sometimes when it's family and friends, but it's really important to draw those lines right now. Um, and this full moon may show you that. It may really illuminate who needs to be in your life and who doesn't. Um, and the people that it sends you that signal that need to be in your life, the Leo full moon is all about reaching out, embracing those people, communicating with them, saying, hey, thank you so much for being my support system. And you may receive that from other people too during this time. So don't be surprised when your leadership skills really start to come through for this full moon. And people are like, hey, you inspire me. Keep doing this. I love it when you do that. Look what I did because of you. You may feel it coming through in yourself too, where you're like, you know what, I was going to start that business or I was going to start that podcast or I was going to start journaling every day or I was going to start getting to the gym three times a week or I was going to start that new yoga class. I was going to take that painting class. I was going to take that ceramics class. And you may really, really be feeling, feeling a nudge um, and a, a strong pull actually during this Leo full moon to set those things underway. Make the phone call. Schedule the class, okay? Put the thing online you've been wanting to put online. Get out that empty notebook that's been sitting around and start journaling in it. This is a time for action because support is around you and behind you with this Leo full moon. A great thing to do during this Leo full moon, we always talk about practicing gratitude, but what I really want you to do is think about the things that you love about yourself and that you have accomplished. Um, they don't need to be big. They could be anything, anything that you're proud of. Your, maybe you're just happy you got through 2023 and Lord, that was enough. So make a list of things small or big or medium that you are proud of, that you have accomplished and allow yourself to revel in that. Allow, when, when we... When we practice gratitude with ourselves and when we appreciate ourselves, we are more aligned with attracting the things in that we want to do, that we want to see achieved in our life, okay? So it's really important to do that and make these gratitude and appreciation lists about ourselves. This is also a great time of balance between reality and maybe what you think is luxury, something you don't think is obtainable, but it really is. It can be a reality. This is a beautiful balance of fulfillment and the beauty and joy in life. And you can have all of those things under this full moon. 
you just have to embrace it, align with this moon's energies, and that's what this service is all about. So each um, astrologic, major astrological event, I offer a service where I inscribe your candle, pray your petition over it, I dress it with an appropriate oil, and I burn that under that astrological event. Um, I then send out photos, and I usually make an oil during it. So I will be making a Leo full moon oil that will be shipped out to you for free. All you have to do is choose that option from the drop down menu. You can purchase just the service or you can purchase the service with the oil. Another thing that may come through during this Leo full moon is your uniqueness. And you may be looking for a way to market that. You may be looking at it as a way to get you noticed maybe in your industry or in a new career field, or maybe it is in, um, maybe you're in some type of educational program, but it's about getting noticed and being noticed for your uniqueness right now. And that's a really important thing to give ourselves. Embrace your uniqueness and notice it. And it's, you know, what's, what do, what do, what do I like about me? Even if it's something that other people, you feel like most people don't like it about you. Trust you, that is the thing that makes you you. And that is the thing that will align you with your real goals. Because there is, the only way we can attra attract what's truly meant for us is to be uniquely ourselves. Acting like someone else or pretending to be somebody else or acting in a way that's not genuinely who we are is just going to get more fakeness and more false friends and more jobs that don't align and more opportunities that are out of align, more um, romantic partnerships that are out of align. So if you have been finding this trend of why am I always drawing in the wrong people? Why am I always drawing in jobs that don't last? Why am I always drawing in friendships that don't last? Are you really uniquely being yourself and just letting it all hang out and letting your freak flag fly? You have to do that to draw in what aligns for you. If you're not, you're drawing in what doesn't align for you. So something to think about under this full moon is really embracing that. And you can add that to the list of things that we talked about earlier. If you're making a list about yourself and you're really wanting to embrace things about yourself that maybe you think rub people the wrong way or you've been told to tone it down a little bit or maybe you're too much or you're not cut out for that industry or, you know, I can't believe you're going to try to start a business in this economy. Don't listen to that BS. There is room for everybody to prosper. There is enough prosperity for everyone. There is enough joy in this life for everyone. There is enough high vibrations in this world for everybody to feel fulfilled. So if I am the only person that you're hearing that from, at least it, you got me, okay? You got me, boo. So forget everybody else and what they're saying and listen to this and work on these things during this Leo full moon. I would love to see you um, during this service. I do have one more video before this one, but I didn't like how it got edited. It, actually, the editing didn't work. So that's kind of why I'm doing a little refresher here. But if you want more information, you can see the video before this one. Join me tonight for the Leo Full Moon Service. I cannot wait to work with you and get you into alignment, alignment with what is really right for you and fulfilling for your life, okay? So link is in bio or below this video. Join me tonight. Get your Leo Full Moon. Um, this is going to be a really empowering, opportunistic oil that draws in um, fulfillment and joy and bountiful positive opportunities to you. Let me get that out to you. I would love to send you a bottle. I will see you tonight during the service. Don't miss out. Can't wait. Be blessed.